Hello, everybody, and welcome to the Wonders of the Lao's Language, Part 2! Okay, so last time I was here, and you were here, and we all were here, we learned Lao's basics number one, hello, goodbye, and the numbers. So today, we are going to learn advanced numbers, and we are going to learn basic phrases and greetings. Fun stuff. And I want to make a little correction. Vowels has six tones, not five. That's still a lot of tones to think about, but... Boy, vowels. What are you doing? What are you doing? So here we go. We are going to learn basic phrases and greetings. I don't know what I'm going to cram into here, but we shall see what happens. Onward, you're going to need to know how to say yes and no. So, even if you don't know how to respond to anything else, you can say yes or no, and that's a good way to get out of a bad situation. So, in Laos, there are two ways to say yes. There's a formal and there's an informal way. How to say yes in Laos informally is... Uh. Uh. Just an uh sound. Uh. Uh. It's, it doesn't even sound right. Formal way of saying Laos is doi, 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 doi. Formal, yes. Informal, uh, formal, doi. No is ba, ba, ba. It's like saying ball without the l. That's another tone in the ba sound. So with just the ba sound, you can say ba, which is no. You can say ba, which is crazy. You can say ba, which is ant. And you can say ba, which is fish. Ba, 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 ba. The Laos language is a barbershop quartet. Boy, balls. The word I, as in I, as in me, as in myself, is koi. Koi. Understanding. This is how to say understand. Um, in Laos, and this is gonna be helpful because you can tell someone you don't understand, and then you won't get lost by people going off on Laos rants at you. I say this a lot. The word for understand is kao chai, kao chai. That's to understand. When you want to say I understand, you you would say koi kao chai. When you want to say I don't understand, Laos doesn't have many like doesn't really have that many words. It's very basic. I don't understand, it's koi ba kao chai. Koi meaning I, ba meaning no, kao chai means understand. When you don't understand somebody, just say koi ba kao chai. You don't even need to say koi, just say ba kao chai. Most of the time, people don't use the word kao chai. That's more of a formal saying. When you don't know something, just say bo hum. You would use it in the context of who to know, like koi who means I know. Koi bo hu means I don't know. When you don't know something, just say bo hu, I don't know. We've learned I, yes, no, to understand and to know, which will help you finagle your way through Laos because you'll basically tell people, I don't know what the hell you're talking about at all, ever. Now, for the final word, because if you go to a house or something, you're gonna need to use the bathroom. I'm gonna teach you guys to say, where is the bathroom? Hong Nam you site. That means where's the bathroom? I'll explain what all those words mean later. But if you need to pee somewhere in Laos or do something else, Hong Nam you site will be very, very helpful. So, this is the end of basic phrases and stuff like that. But now we're on to advanced numbers. Uh, it's crunch time for Laos speaking. Last time we learned how to count from 0 to 10. Now I'm going to teach you guys to count forever and onward. The weird thing in Laos is learning the word 11 or the concept of the number 1 in front of another number, and that's true. We're going to teach you what that concept is. It's really easy though, so don't get frightened. In Laos, here we go. Soon nung song sam si ha ho jet back. 11 is sip et, and that's all. Now, now that's just not for 11. That's for any time that you have the number one after another number. So the word 
21, the word 31, the word 41, it's always et. The counting gets easier after that. After you learn the word 10 and 11, which is sip et, 12 is nothing special. It's just sip, which is 10, and song. 13 is sip, which is 10, and sam, which is 3. See the trend? Can you figure out what the number 15 is going to be? That's right, 15 is seep, which is 10, and ha, which is 5, which makes up the word 15. Once you hit 19, you learn a new word for the word 20, which is sal, 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 sal. Seep, seep et, seep song, seep sam, seep si, seep ha, seep hok, seep jet, seep bat, seep gao. Sal. After sal comes the word 21. Word for 21 is... If you said sal it, you're correct. It's the concept of the number one after the number two. So, from there, what do you think is going to happen next? That's right. You're going to use the word sal and the word two, which is song. So the word 22 is sal song. And the word 23 is sao sam, word 24 is sao si, sao ha, sao hok, sao jet, sao bat, sao gao. Then something different happens. So this is one last concept to learn. The word 30 in Laos does not have its own special word. The word 30 is sam, si, which means 310. And you keep doing that pattern. It changes for 100, so we're going to forget that. We're not going to count to 100 this video, we're just going to count to 99. Because the word for 31 would be... That's right! Sam, si, et. After that, you just keep doing the same thing that you've been doing. 32 is Sam, si, song. And onward, and onward, and onward until you reach 99. 100 has its own different word. So that will be in advanced numbers, advanced, advanced, advanced version where we can count to wherever you want to. Not that you really count that much anymore because we aren't eight. So you've just gotta remember these things. Just keep re-watching this video and you'll figure it out. Bah! So I've taught you guys a lot of things this time around. I think I'm running out of time for this video. So instead of doing the review in this video, I'm going to make another video to do the review in, which I'm going to post in the sidebar. So click that video for a review of Laos Basics 2. Thanks for watching, guys. Click this next video. Leave comments in the section below. Thanks. Bye.